time it's apparently. Uh, 3.30 a.m. now. Uh, let's see here. So, yeah, we covered that. I think we were caught up on everything there. Uh, let me see. I guess I'll ask if everyone's going to bed. We're going to be up a while. I'm really, I probably have no business doing chapter 11, but I could just to kind of get a head start. If I don't do chapter 11, I'm not going to upgrade any because I just go to bed, in all honesty. But uh, I could try to breeze through Willikin Workshop. Oh, yeah, 10.30 a.m. Uh, <laughs> well, I guess, every, like I said, I uh, do a lot with people across the other side of the word, world. So, uh, I could try to do it. I mean, I'm I'm tired, but I'm not... You know, like, decrepitly tired. Yeah, Tim's on the west coast, he's got that two hours on. If it was 1.32 a.m., I'd jump in uh, already, be doing it. Uh, this is actually, this is a lot of people for 3.30 in the morning. Yeah, yeah I guess I'll do it. I'll, I'll go in and we'll just see what happens. Alright, so this is now, I know it's going to say Secret Sewers of Supreme Stink, but I don't really know how to change that midstream, so we're not going to, and we'll just uh, go straight to Chapter 11, and then I'll hope that I can highlight this appropriately, <laughs> so. Wowzers, can you believe Chaos is actually going to come with us on a ride-along? Never thought I'd see the day, but I guess he sure loves that Willikin factory. Ready to go check it out? Alrighty! Buckle up your safety belt, Skylander! And Chaos. Because we're about to make Skyland's history today. Uh, boom! I kind of wanted to see how this panned out. So, um... Someone and Dr. Crankcase. Who is that? They all look so similar. You know. Ah, there it is. My old Willikin factory. Mother said I'd never be able to make friends, but I proved her wrong. I made hundreds <laughs> of them. Out of wood. Oh, Dr. Crankcase is there. Wait, what happened to my Willikin factory? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I don't know. I'm still kind of creeped out about the whole you making friends out of wood thing. Yeah, I've seen enough. I demand you take me down there at once. Okay, here we are. Hey, short stuff, while you're in there, can you pick me up some churros? Oh, I've told you several times, Flick. My factory doesn't make churros! Hey, it's no wonder you didn't have any friends. Oh, well. See ya! Okay, uh, undead gate over there. This is actually pretty cool, so I guess this is like, uh... Willikin World. Just a little updated or something, and taken over in evil because of uh, Doctor Crankcase, I guess. All right, so we've got probably a whole bunch of doors. Oh, hello, hidden ledge I didn't expect to find, but look for anyway. Um, the shame that's all there was was cash. I was hoping to be like a soul gem. Speaking of that, uh, let's actually check our objectives here. Defeat Dr. Crankcase. We got a sweet battle here with the Doom Raider. Uh, no lives lost, 19 areas, 60 enemies. Um, what is that guy? Fisticos? I don't know. Uh, magic and Undead. We can finally go in the Magic Gate. That's cool. One Story Scroll, four treasure chests, two Soul Gems, the Winged Sapphire, Legendary Treasure. Only two hats, so that's nice. But uh, we'll back out of here and see what we can do. So into the house as we go. Hopefully you don't have to go in all of them. Uh, that sounds tedious, but uh, we'll see what we can do. Pretty cool looking level though, when you get right down to it. Oh no, it's just like I remember. I wonder if you have to like use the little time shifter things again. Uh, so this looks to be a villain quest, let's see what it is. Yeah. 
for I think what Shield Trader. Hi there, stranger. We are a Willikin band. Making music is fun, but sound much better if we had a special noise. If Shield Shredder come play in our <sighs> band, he makes special noise, and we give you special surprise. Okay, um, so we know... I love it when the villain quests are here early in chapters, because for villainography that works out very well. Uh, so Shield Shredder's quest is at the start of, literally the very start of the chapter, which is awesome. Um... I don't feel like Cobra Cadaver is well suited to this area. He just he doesn't look really in place at this point in time. All right, so this is cool. We got our meditations on Boom, uh, which is really one of my favorite things. Oh, I didn't even. Where is that at? What? Well, I guess this button did that. Uh, interesting. <laughs> I'm not sure where that was, but I'll I'll go look for it. I didn't see a treasure chest up there. Of course not we won't only read it. do I fly ships, but I fix them too. Even when they don't have the spare parts and they're not broken in the first place. <sighs> Interestingly, I am uh Right after I start this, I start getting really tired and yawning. But I didn't really want to, I kind of wanted to see what went down with Chaos. You know? Why am I backtracking? Because if I missed the Willikin guys having like access to something here, a treasure chest, I would feel like an idiot. And while we can still backtrack, we should backtrack. So I don't guess it was in here. Um... Yeah, so somewhere we lowered a gate to a treasure chest. I just, uh, maybe it's like in a neighboring house. I guess they want you to go into the big one first, and then maybe backtrack to that one. I don't know. We'll go in here, if we can. That ridiculous oh. Dr. Crankcase probably has the factory all locked up. But I know a secret way in. Glumshanks was always forgetting the key, so I made him dig out this underground tunnel. I'll squeeze through and open the door from the inside. Meet you there, Sky Loser. Er, I mean, Friender. Awkward. <laughs> okay, uh, so he'll deal with that, and I want to come. Oh, okay. So, once again, I kind of tend to go where I'm not intended to go. Treasure seeker. Uh, we don't really probably have to talk to him because we're awesome. And uh, we did this backwards and it worked beautifully. Alright. Makes sense for Chomp Chest to get to do that. I have found a couple other chapters where he can get some decent cash fairly quickly, but chapter one is just super easy. You figure out way to open gate from outside, so that's why I couldn't do it. I never leave. Yep. <laughs> okay. So he's a wreck. That guy is a wreck. Tuning in. Whoops. How did we not grab this already? Anyway, um, so yeah, we reverse engineered that one too. It's a pretty pretty common thing I do. Is uh, I guess not what I'm supposed to. Now can we go in there? Guess not. Lots of little things on this level that are probably going to be problematic to figure out. Uh, looks like this one will slide over and then in, so we've got that going for us. We'll run up top, but will that do something special? Is the question. So we've been in there. Um, I guess we'll just hit this and see what happens. Before we do that, let's make sure we can't drop off a ledge or something crazy. Well, we can, <laughs> but for no reason. Alright. So, I don't know quite what that did, but aside from, like, provide us a bridge. So, rail car repair station. Hi, stranger. This factory is under new ownership. New master is not friend to Willikin like old master, but smell much better. I like the time. You want to pull this switch? Go ahead. It will be fun. 
No, there's a house here that we have to explore. Rail car repair shop. Hopefully we didn't need that stuff. <laughs> Now, Chapter 10 was a nightmare. I never did get the cash payout, and since we jumped right into 11, <laughs> we got it. So, Chapter 10, I will investigate that further. Chapter 11 was very simple. Alright, so we're not touching that switch until we go in that undead gate. Alright, so... This would be a good area for shortcut, I think. Kinda looks like somewhere you would find him. But we don't have shortcut, but we do have Crypt King, and that's awesome. A trap master of the undead I had no idea, Eon. That's why we weren't talking about it. Okay. It's also getting very, very cool now, and that makes me sleepy. Er. <laughs> that was a really cool blue. Uh, that was actually just a really neat sequence in general. So. Crypt King is going in. I'd like to get him a different hat. I think we could find one that looks better. Alright. <sighs> Skylanders of the undead element. So toy are return. In this zone. Okay, that's opening. Would have been a cool to have something up there. Um didn't shut behind us. Oh. What do you know? A will to conquer. Significant enemies are present. Right. So Crypt King and Nitro Crypt King are both up here, so they've got that going for them. Speaking of that, I doubt that they would have, you know, a treasure chest hidden in here, but you never know. And this is the only way to find out, so. This is the type of stuff I do off camera. Just seemingly pointless research. Not for no reason. Because I enjoy it. And let's let Chomp Chest have at it for a little bit. Uh, Chomp Chest is not to be underestimated. Uh, this guy is a beast of mine. Kinda like Tussle Sprout. I think a lot of people just kinda like, ah, he sucks. And he doesn't. And people are unaware of that. Does eating food extend his time? Oh, I can't eat food. Kind of a bummer. I still thought villains should be able to extend their time. That was an idea I pitched. As they gathered XP, I thought it should, like, increase it. Uh, anyway, it all goes to uh, Crypt King, anyway. So. Alright, so I guess we should switch, actually. Uh, he needed no pizza, but he ate the pizza. Alright. Only thing I wish, and it, it should have been addressed with Nitro Crypt King, but I wish he was a little quicker. Would have been very nice. Can you break the puzzle? I'm puzzled. I meant to say a present. Avoid that. Uh, this looks pretty intense. Alright. There's our hat. Maybe this will be a good hat for him. I can't remember. It seemed like that one had decent stats I kind of liked. We'll see what this one is. If I can open it. Oh, that looks like a cheesy hat to me. Plus 20 critical hit. I don't believe in critical hit. No. Insult me with a stupid hat like that. Alright, let's get out of here. Again, that music is its still classic to me. Uh, good old-fashioned SSA. Getting down to business. Alright. You know what, I should probably switch just for the sake of it. But I think we can now hit that and see what happens. Pretty cool little deal here. This looks like drill sergeant territory now. You make trains come out, see? Fun. Um, can we stop that? 
Let's see what happens when he runs out of track. Oh, he bails. Okay. Uh, let me actually switch over to Mr. Kaboom, because he is not upgraded. And he actually needs cash, too. So it's the best of both worlds, really. And he's got an awesome hat. So. Uh, very, very cool here, all of a sudden. Oh, nice! He got the snipe shot there. I thought he did. So now they're just sending unoccupied cars. Now, what happens if we were to jump on one of these and try to ride it off? Or can we go off? Yes, but we come back. Okay. Oh, and they can be killed by cars. I'm surprised that's not like a little goal in the chapter. Kill X numbers of shield shredders. Watch this, we're just gonna let him get mowed from behind because we're crafty. That's right, charge up. And get hit by your own real car. So that's kind of a cool little deal. But again, it wouldn't be neat if there was like, you know, mow down ten shield shredders with real cars. Okay. Uh, is Kaboom fast enough? Can we jump on that? No. We might be able to. I've gotta try it. You know, I've gotta try it. So we're gonna sit here. Actually, we'll do a long range battle with that loser. Let me see if I can jump on it. Ah, let me get rid of him first. Well, that gun, they got another one. So we'll eradicate all of these guys. And then we will go about that. Well, dang. I thought we were gonna dodge that. Okay, so. I don't know what those top thingy looking dudes are, but. Can we get more rail cars to spawn? Maybe? So now I can't jump on it. Ah, disappointment. It reigns supreme tonight. Um, I'll research it. I mean, if you could, I guess you just like cascade off and respawn anyway. But, uh, it's just I kind of like it doing. I don't know what those are, like Willikin Warriors or something. Um, I miss the way they would introduce new enemies in the previous games. Uh, kind of, they have apparently pretty good health too. Oh, good grief! Um, goodbye, Kaboom. And hello, Dark Wildfire. Dark Wildfire, I took down Chain Champion. I actually like the Shield Slasher path best, but uh, we'll we'll let him go here, and uh, he's not near as high level. Well, these guys are apparently pretty tough, whatever they are. Those little looking guys. And then they kind of come in for auxiliary support and then get slaughtered. Okay, so this is a pretty intense little battle area. Something interesting in the wildfire upgrades is that if you go shield slasher, it actually improves everything, including soldier damage. A lot of people are unaware of. Garbage <clears throat> day, see? Scrap scrap shooter. Okay, that's they all look so similar. Now it makes sense. We've been dealing with him for a while. Uh, obviously, he's someone that does not get pulled in by the chains. Once you you can uh, use that to do some long range damage. If you're so inclined. Oh wow! Did not see that. Um, let's get uh, Wildfire in here and kind of let him finish his own business. So these guys were finally getting to some hard-hitting enemies, and you have to remember I've got low-level Skyliners for the most part. Uh, it's a nice setup. Oh, I don't even know how we killed him. I guess our level up did it. So scrap shooter is who it was. Okay. Put a fire trap in the portal to trap this villain. Uh, we will do villainography on him very soon. And I actually have. I think I'm set on fire traps. Uh, his sky stone will come in handy too. So, um, now can we go in there or do we go that direction? I don't know. So let's try this. 
This would have been a great spot to have hidden something, uh, if I don't say so myself. Let's see here, I see nothing really special that we would have missed. I'd like to get, there's a soul gem down there. Can't tell who it's for from here. Um, looks similar to Deja Vu, as the closest character I can think of. It actually looks like Rage Mage to me. But uh, I know they don't have soldiers. Stronger in this villains. There you go, buddy. You go do your villain thing. Eh? And uh, let's see what happens. I don't want to talk to Chaos in case that like triggers something. Uh, let's figure out how to get down here and do that. And then, oh, did not see these guys even coming. Uh, but I am really wondering if Chomp Chest Quest. These trains must be taking raw materials out to Crankcase's army. My raw materials. I'm really wondering if Crankcase. What am I? Jeez, not Crankcase. Chomp Chest Quest will give him that machine gun because he will just be sinisterly awesome uh, if that is the case. So let's go ahead and switch back. And I'm hoping we can just drop straight down and procure this soul gem. Let me try to kind of look ahead. We've got those guys. We've got some Traptanium over there. There's a magic gate down there. Okay, so you can't go down on that. There we go. That's the sweet spot. Oh, Fling Kong! Uh, one of my most anticipated Skylanders. So I should have thought of that. I could make out the little hat structure there. But uh, let's... I'm excited to see this, actually. Alright, Fling Kong. He's kind of like my Trap Team War NATO. Uh, very, very excited about this guy. So, Make it rain! He's even got an awesome Soul Gym name. So how can you not like a monkey on a magic carpet with a Soul Gym called Make It Rain? Alright, we're going to preview Fling Kong. Oh, yeah. Yep, he's gonna be awesome. Oh, and he's got the static he can leave. Yeah, I totally agree, Chomp Chest. Uh, Chomp Chest and I have better conversations than I do with uh, Brawl and Chain. He's kind of Brawl and Chain strikes me as the type of walrus that would drive around in a van and says free candy, you know, and uh, that's just kind of creepy. So. There are steps here. Now wait, let me, I'm gonna check this ledge. Okay, now we know. Let me see if we can drop down to that magic gate yet. I'm not quite sure where you enter to get to it. Can we jump from here? Well, you totally should be able to, but they're not gonna let us. Um, there is a bounce pad down there though. Oh, good grief. Uh, we should be safe here, I think. Yeah, okay, we're good, we're good. Can't jump on that. I don't know what triggered these trains all of a sudden. Uh, where did that XP come from? Okay, let's see what's going on with the trains. So they're able to ride that. I guess those uh, two enemies got hit, or fell, in pursuit of us or something that were there? I don't know. Interesting stuff. But, uh, let's try to use this to cross and then kind of take it from there. Let's see if there's anything in the crates. Not really. <laughs> okay. So maybe now we can drop down to that magic area. I want to do that before we proceed. Well, there's a doorway there, too. Okay. So we did the right thing so far. I assume you're supposed to get to the magic area from up there, but I don't ever like to play on the assumption, so that'll shoot us up that direction, so maybe not, I don't know. But uh, we're just going to get blast your mind and have at it here. So, Like I said, I tend to go into things backwards a lot, but... Uh, mind over um, matter. <laughs> yeah, that was a pretty good battle. Um, What's up with the buffer? I have no idea. It looks pretty decent on my end. Uh, let's see here. Tim is hungry. I, now I want goldfish. Let me see. 
Uh, I'll try to catch up on the chat right here real quick is what I'll do. Uh, sick at home, man. Hope you get better. Um, Power of Persephone. <laughs> yeah, that was a good comment. Um, Vita, the few people I know that have a Vita like it. Um, how does money work in Swap Force if you have Freeze Buckler? It gets XP and gold. There was the other three, and you the diamond. Yeah, if you're in Swap Force, just put the Sky Diamond down in the training grounds and go to town. Um, let's see here. Yeah, Drill Sergeant, I would have busted out if he wasn't like buried in a stack here, because that's what the trains remind me of. Um, enemy intros will be missed. Totally agree there. Alright. Yeah, you know what? Some of the SSA guys are really cheap now. Uh, like locally here, but not all of them. You know, you've got like Hex and Zook and uh, a couple of the others. I've actually found two Series 2 Flame Slingers at Toys R Us. But uh, I think I've caught up on the chat, and we got our Elemental Gates goal here. So. Skylanders of the Magic Ooh. are stronger in this. This is an easy hat. We'll just break this to kind of get the money. Uh, very cool backgrounds here. Uh, Secret Sewers of Supreme Stink actually had a very nice mosaic tile and mural theme through most of the level. But, uh, mash, mash, mash. I don't think any hat would actually look good on Blaster Mind because he's basically wearing one. But Little Elf Hat, plus 8 speed, might stick that on Stealth Elf at some point in time. Let's just see what it looks like. This hat is mind blowing. Uh, it looks I'm ridiculous. Serious. It does make a noted difference in his speed, and he looks festive. Um, I guess we're prepping for Christmas 2015. I thought that was a little indention here. I guess it's not. Let me make sure you can't break it. That would have been a great spot to hide a treasure chest, actually. So we're back up here, and now apparently you can go in this door too. So. I guess we'll do that. Oh no. Sneaky Pete Slim. Okay. They look like Sky Stones, people. But it's a quest. Pirates of the Broken Table. Arr, matey. Tis a game of Sky Stone Smash we wish to play. But alas, our table, it stands no more. What if you were to bring us none other than Scrap Shooter? I'm sure he could fix our table right up. You'd always be welcome to play with us if such an arrangement was made. Okay, that works beautifully for me. I'm not a huge fan yeah, of the Sky Stone Smash. And since I do villainography, we can just kind of wait. Let's actually see if there's any hits. Oh, jeez. Okay, he's quick, he's quick. Interesting. Let's stop there. All too convenient, Mr. Train. Alright. Oh, I was afraid that might happen. <laughs> okay. So, there for a while, the train's like just. I guess we should just... It's gonna take forever. We'd fall off every ledge with this charge attack. So. Alright, now the question... Well, chaos. Let me in this instant! Alright, he is very angry about his Willikin workshop being taken over. Oh, I did not see that guy come up beside us there. So we'll just play mind games with him. And him. And him. And him. And him, and him, and we'll just kill them with our primary attack. For a I'm sorry, secondary. That is secondary. Okay. Oh, we got a scrap shooter coming. I wish those guys looked slightly different. Like you know, since he's a fire element villain, maybe if he—I well, mean, granted, when he does that, you can tell. Uh, it would be nice if they had like a little, uh, I don't know, like a color change perhaps would be you know, adequate. I don't know if we killed the guy behind us or not. Um, I wonder what would happen if we went in that door while we're fighting Scrap Shooter. You know what? Speaking of that. 
<laughs> Chomp Chest comes in and gets it done in one hit. Okay, uh, I thought of him because of this treasure back here. So let's go ahead and do my ubiquitous research here. And there is no hidden ledge there. Now for this side, there is also no hidden ledge. So now you know, and you don't have to do what I do. Let me just kind of backtrack here, make sure we didn't miss anything. That's actually worth checking as well. Okay, you simply can't jump off that part. And now I've got the issue of how in the world do I get back up there. Which I guess this is the answer to that. So, it wasn't as complicated as I thought. Uh, now they've got like these riser platforms here, and I'm not sure how I feel about them. Let me just, it's easier to do it with a full-size character, I think. Alright, so, we've got to check this out now. That orange wedge will come in handy uh, once we get over there. I guess that riser is to get to chaos, actually. So, Rochester's house. We blow everything we can up, Rochester, to collect money from you. Since you're never going to leave your house until chaos comes back to play. Yeah, that actually got us full. Let's see what he has to say. All right, dream creature. This will be good. Hi there. I have been trying to sleep for a long time, but not able to do it. No sleep is no fun. Maybe dream catcher come and make me fall asleep. Could be special fun. Sounds like a horrible idea, but I guess we'll oblige him. Villains are strong. Uh, when we show. get the chance. So. Oh, I've never heard him say that. The old mill, I'm guessing something is hidden behind that. Correct. So, um, I'm sure some people would come in here and, like, just be like, oh, there's nothing in this room. What a waste. And then they would finish the chapter and be like, where's the wing sapphire? Oh, and there's a Sky Stones player dead. Gummit. Ugh. I don't. I don't not. I mean. <laughs> I really wish Sky Stones was limited to the Academy, you know, like you complete a level and you unlock a new person to battle or something, but I guess we'll breeze through one. Haha, <laughs> his name's Yarhar. Right uh. Okay, so we'll do this. But in the further interest of being straightforward, I must tell ye that G will surely lose. Yeah, that wouldn't surprise me. Yeah, we'll just run with whatever they say and see what happens. He's got 13 health to begin with. Hood sickle. Hood sickle. All right. Let's see here. I really this just like kills the entire flow of the game is why I don't like it and that really bothers me um, and it's not like you have to do it to progress I think a couple of times you have had to do it but uh, I don't know I just I don't I feel like it needs to be left at the Academy that's what my thoughts are on it shield shredder Shrednaught. Okay. I haven't seen Shrednaught, I don't think, in a while. <sighs> Guess we'll just, uh... Throw that down, maybe? Nah, let's do this, I guess. Luminous. Heart boost. Reach for the stars! Okay, Lego. other thing is someone that records that Sky Stones were very prone to dropping frames and giants and that always bothered me <laughs> but uh, okay so he's got ice cream two hits three hearts and we will counter that with Krankenstein, Krankenstein three hits three hearts can't 
can undercount our one hit luminous down there. Cross crow. Alright, so cross crow is dealt. And let's go ahead. She'll do three, so Dream catcher. We'll just go ahead and get the Lightning open hits. Strike. Heads up. Technically it'll be a five point play for her, and then if you add in luminous, it's six, so not too shabby. And you can't cover everybody, so hopefully... I scream. Ha! That was a dumb play. Okay, um... So Luminous will do one there. Let's just go ahead and, uh... Throw this down. And that should eliminate... Jack, Pepper Jack. Fireball. I, well, no, that only does one, doesn't it? Spice it up! He's got some sweet pants, that Pepper Jack, I tell you. So Yar Har is not faring so well. Finally lost Luminous. I'm surprised he lasted that long. But... Brawl and chain. Okay. Um, now it's time for Nightshade to come. Nightshade. On. Lightning strike. And KO that sucker. Prepare for a thrashing. Yes. Best line ever. So technically he should be lower than that. In my opinion. And that was a slaughter fest. We defeated Yar Har. Har 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 Har. Uh, that was actually a decent payout, too. Perhaps me skills may not be what they used to be. But give me another chance, and I'm sure to get me mojo back. Outsmarting the rest. Uh, no. I don't want to do that again. Even though we won, I it kills the flow of the game, and that bothers me immensely. Villains are stronger. Okay, so... Yes, we do. Um, can we make that? No, you literally have to use that. So. Quick, get in here, Skylander. It's much worse than I thought. <laughs> All right. Now I don't know if like Chaos is already communicating with the Doom Raiders or if he's still anti Doom Raider or what exactly. So this is the factory, and this looks like somewhere. Just look at this. First, that idiot crate has removed all my demotivational plaques. <laughs> Second, today is supposed to be Evil Donut Day. Do you see any evil donuts around here? I don't. And then there's this. <gasps> I ask you, what have I ever done to deserve this? On second thought, don't answer that. <sighs> oh, you go ahead. I need a moment. I'll come find you once I conquer my furious rage. Okay, so some deep-seated... Oh, can't backtrack out of here. <laughs> some deep-seated issues for Chaos. Uh, hilarious ones, but uh, can't talk to him. Uh, this looks to me like an area that you should have, like, Sprocket or Drobots. Uh, that's kind of what I'm feeling tech-wise. There's that Traptanium. Let's see. Let's see here, we should get a bounce pad there eventually. Uh, these guys look totally different in here than they did outside, but they're not to be underestimated. What was he shooting at? I mean, seriously, dude? He just like auto locked on to nothing. And uh, I did not know they could come up here. Let's learn as we do. Okay, oh, I thought we killed that. Okay, finally we got him. Exactly right. as I predicted. Yes, it is, Chompalicious, my friend. You're gonna get yourself the villain stash. All right, so perfect character for this. And then there's another treasure chest back behind the Traptanium. So uh, consider it his chompy day. And there's railing, so I can actually keep him in charge and not go flailing off into the void blue. So, alright, let's uh, let him break this and we'll switch over to Blaster again. I'd let Chomp just do this, but, you know, you gotta be a trap master with a trap team. <sighs> alright, smashing through. 
Uh, all the money for these new characters has not been done with the money trick. It's all been hard-earned the old-fashioned way. So. Alright, it is very, very cold here. Uh, my feet are not happy. There's Persephone. I wish it was Marsha. Uh, now she is guarded by some crazy guy. Again, I really wish they'd do the little intros, you know, or have, like, name tags with the villains. I think it would be the nice thing to do. Uh, we're not going to buy upgrades because we record all that. So, if I didn't record, I would totally do that. I'd just kind of kind of be like, wow, I've got enough money to upgrade this person. And where did he come from? Did not know he was here. Uh, luckily, that other guy is staying back. Uh, it would be funny if he got, like, drilled over there. I guess he's just not going to come fight, so we'll just stand here and uh, go about it in this manner. Come on, buddy. I was trying to get him under the drill, but I, that would be a waste of time. Let's just go over there and kill the nuts, I guess is what we'll do. Try to avoid the drill. Um. Make sure, let me go back and make sure we didn't miss anything. I don't think we did. Oh, well, what do you know? Good thing we went back. Uh, does this damage us? I don't think it will. Well, actually, we can't jump in it. Uh, so there's a nice little painting. They didn't uh, vandalize that one, at least. Put the gold bow on chaos. Can't jump off. Yeah, you can, actually. Uh, any hidden ledges down here? Doesn't look like it. Of the tech, tech I call that. Um, I guess we could put Treadhead down. I mean, that, I know Gear Shift is an option, Jawbreaker. Well, I don't know. I'd actually do Elite Trigger Happy, but I'm going to take him down Golden Money Bags and then reset him to take him down Happiness as a Golden Gun, which is my preferred path. I don't really want him to get any cash. So a treasure chest we may need to backtrack for. I don't know how Treadhead's gonna fare against these guys actually. Well, decent. But oh no. What is over here? This switch must do something important. Maybe lower the gate. Ah, yes. So, but yeah, it's not timed. Which usually, back in the old days, that would have been a time switch, and you'd have to like have Stealth Hill for Zap to do that, or Flame Slinger. People always forget the Flame Slinger. So we got all the treasure chests, that's cool. We got the Winged Sapphire, which is kind of my big deal. Let's go ahead and check that. Alright, so one more enemy, uh, three more areas. This level's gone pretty quick, I think. Or I've just like been asleep or just extremely enjoyed it. Um, one more soul gem and one legendary treasure. So three areas, I feel like we could pull that off. In all honesty. This turned out to be a good decision to stay up until after four in the morning. It usually does. People are always hesitant. Um, there's a platform over there. Uh, so we... Oh, I guess it's not. It looks like one. Would have been a really good hiding spot. Um, we got through here. Did we do everything? Let me backtrack. I think we have. Okay, so that was the enemy area, and there is the switch on that other side. I think we're ready to progress, actually. Can we make it? Yes. And you can go back down, so that's good to know. And now I guess it is time to bring in gear shift. I tried to avoid it, but it was not meant to be. Nothing against her, I just, I kind of think it's, I don't know, I tend to gravitate towards the core character. Now, she has a dorky hat. Again, people always say, you never wear hats when I'm easy. So I'll throw them down from time to time. And I regret it because I see them later, and I think I should not put that Oh, that's a soul gem in there. So we can finally upgrade Head Rush, I guess. Um, actually, I'm waiting on Nitro Head Rush, which that may be a problem to find. So, new powers unlocked, horns aplenty. Let's get a feel for this. 
It'll be interesting to see her in a little video. I've heard people like her when she's up here. Apparently people are big fans of the Yodel attack. Uh, the Yodel attack looked powerful. Okay, so we just need the legendary treasure now, I think. Let's double check. And defeat Crankcase, so that should be fun. One enemy and one legendary treasure. Epic sauce right there. Alright. Hey, okay, I was worried we were going to get hit. Wait, was that a mine? I guess those are mines. Okay, so... Live and learn. Let's get out of here. The mines are not something I want to continue with, really. We got the enemy gold, so that's awesome. Still areas to go as well. Um, gear shift. I told everybody to get her. And everyone's like, man, they said you had to pre-order her, and she's not, you know, she's like everywhere. I think she's going to be very hard to come by for quite some time. And I tried to warn people. We'll see if I'm right. Alright, so production, I thought it halted, but it has not. Okay, so there are mines in there. I had to check. <laughs> yeah. Um, I, I don't think they'd be cruel enough to put the legendary treasure in there. There we go. Let's hit this. Okay, so that comes back down. Okay, so are they all mines? Just about. Do they only do two damage? Yeah, so not a big deal if you get hit by them. But hint, pick up the bomb. I do not see the bomb, or I would pick up said bomb. Alright, where is the bomb? Okay. Train loading and dropping. What? Pick up bomb. I I assume they must mean to pick up a bomb with the crane or something. Um. Hmm. I don't. I've yet to see a bomb. Really. That's a cool little chaos floating speaker head of doom thing. P A. Okay, so hint, pick up bomb. But can we break everything? No? Anything? Can we break crates just for fun? Can we do anything with this aside from pick up the bomb? Seems to me like you should be able to break things with the crane. There we go. That's what I wanted to do. Let's come back over here. Maybe like have to have a perfectly placed cross here or something. I guess you can't break this. Um, can we... Let's try our luck with these crates. Thank you. Although we got nothing from it. Uh, can we pick up treasure? I assume we can't. You can't actually even get over there. So there's some coinage. That's probably where we need to go later, I guess. And there's the bomb, presumably. Okay, so, uh, what do you know? Not too shabby. Let's see if we can break the drills, actually. That's kind of what I'm wondering. So... Well, Chaos, you know, I'll do that, but I want to play around with it. Have we become Glumshanks? I mean, is that is that kind of what's going on here? Okay. Uh, you can't break them. So now we know I, that was a direct hit on the drill, and it's apparently impervious to damage. Surprised he didn't complain about that. Actually. Okay, you can't go back to the crane. I was wondering if there was like something hidden somewhere we could maybe break a barrier on. 
Okay, very cold here. Um, very, very cold. So I technically blew that drill up. But, uh, uh, she doesn't need money, but I'm too lazy to switch. <laughs> That's what that comes down to, basically. Um, I I wonder if gear shift number two has the cash or not. She is still in the packaging, so I can tell them apart. Um, well, I was actually not done in there, but whatever. So, path to crankcase. So, his lair is up there that looks just like the Power A crankcase lair, which is awesome. Uh, looks like we're going to get shot at now. And where is my legendary treasure? I thought that was a little cave down there. Um, areas is what I want to see here. 18 of 19, new. No. Where's the legendary treasure at? It's gotta be somewhere. I'm not even concerned about the enemies, I'm concerned about my legendary treasure because I don't want to get this thing 100%. Um, I don't know, like, if you enter a crankcase's lair and it's just automatic boss fight and you're up a creek if you don't have everything or what exactly is gonna go down there. Those are, oh, seem to be anything we can go to. Um, you guys could just tell me where the legendary treasury is, that would be fantastic. Oh, good grief. Did not realize who we were dealing with. <laughs> that crankcase's lair is super cool. Uh, very, very neat. It glows. It's in my, uh, room here and it like it just literally glows. I don't know how we tank out Frankenstein about this guy. Um, it, it looks very neat at night time, I will tell you that. With the lights out, mind you. But where is the legendary treasure at? That looks like a cave, but it's not. I mean, I'd imagine we walk in there and since it's the 19th area, you just like go straight to work against him. But I don't know for sure. Maybe it's like hidden on the sides of his house. <laughs> Another classic SSA uh, trick of the trade. Okay, well that was not supposed to be me going off a ledge there. It just it honestly. No, it auto locked. I was going to explore. What? So where is the legendary treasure? Well, hello. Oh, maybe you have to play Sky Stone or something. Sky I've heard so much about. Yes. No, really, I'm asking. Just want to make sure I'm talking to the right guy here. Oh, great, great, all right. Well, let's do this then. Dr. Crankcase. Okay, Doom Raider 10. Hey, let's see what you got, pal. Now, I'm let's still wondering if I could possibly find the legendary treasure, so I'm going to have to ask that you refrain from attacking me while I explore. And I don't think we're going to find it here, so... so you laugh, man. Very similar um, skill sets here. Hey, Time to bring up my old buddy, Mr. I don't know, I tend to just right now, box stock, gear shift, I tend to have the best luck with this. Um, she's not upgraded. So. Filling the vats with go, filling the vats with go, I'm filling the vats with go. Kinda catchy. Hey, hey, hey. I just realized what this party needs. Barrel. It needs legendary <laughs> treasures. Yes, man. yes. Drop my beloved barrel baddies. Oh wow, that's actually kind of cool. Um, big fan of the barrel baddies. I guess you could break the barrels before they become barrel baddies. Uh, but then again, if you're over here doing that and you can't break those, which is again probably a dynamic intended to encourage people to play with their friends or parents or buy a second control. I don't know. There's some cheap shots on it. Then he got some on these. Uh, he's kind of like a Dr. Octopus Mad Hatter. Willy Wonka type bad guy. More barrel baddies. 
That's a cool concept, though, really, with the little barrel guys. I think it's kind of neat. Oh, that reminds me! Speaking of bad guys, check this out! What the? I demand that you release me! Hey, ow! <laughs> he demands! That's a good one. Hey, I just hope we can... Seems like Chaos would just obliterate that guy. Okay, what is this? I assume that will damage me? Let's find out. No, it just slows you down a lot. Apparently, so. Learning as we go. I wonder if you can go in the goo yourself. <laughs> uh, that's something I wonder I won't test here. I'll do that on my own time. In the event that it would like catastrophically obliterate us from the planet or something. I didn't mean to get the orange witch. Hang on a sec. I just got the most wonderful idea. This guy means business. What is this like, Mr. Razor Blade Arms or something? I'm a little late to the party. The important thing is that you showed up. Now help me take down this Skylander, will ya? Things just got awesome. As fun as that sounds, I think I'm gonna leave that part up to you. But I would like to borrow Chaos for a spell here. Hey! Stop that! And the plot thickens. Well, you can't trust an undead werewolf. Who can you trust, right? <laughs> Guess we better get back to that big battle of ours. But I'm just warning you here. I might have to turn it up a notch or two. Well, he certainly wasn't exactly. So, Crankcase is a pretty cool little dude. Um, Wolfgang came. Oh, wow, that does a lot of damage to you if you get in the dude. Trying to get back to the center of the platform just was not happening. Um, those conveyor belts are moving very quickly. We got this guy again. Uh, that goo, if it just slows us down again, that's actually not a bad thing to have there. Because it would basically keep us from going in. Oh, that was Frankenstein. I can't really see. I mean, Crank is not Crank. Uh, this is like an overload of large characters. And things were overly dramatic for him when he's not the villain of the battle. But, uh, I'm saying something important. Let's take this guy. I'm not going to lose a Skylander in this battle, so... Uh, she did pretty good. I think she leveled up several times. Uh, who do we want to use? I don't know what level Jawbreaker is. Uh, I guess we'll go... Uh, what do we want to do? So many options. So many options. You know what, let's let Wildfire get back in. Wait, who's good with goo? Who would be someone that I would see with goo? Hmm. Not really anyone. <laughs> but, uh... Jeez. I'm just trying to think who we should put in the game. You know what? I think this. I, I started to do this and then I held off. And uh, I'm gonna do it. Um, I just put one on the trap chain. I've got Legendary Bouncer on there. I guess they don't want me to use him. Hmm. Well. I thought it'd be cool to use Legendary Bouncer. Oh, good grief. 
Oh, that's stupid as a case. I mean, I know we get the bonus damage and everything. Well, this is like, I feel like it's glitched really bad. Let me just let him have a fair crack at it. I think we could have killed him, but I just quit attacking so we could have like a more epic battle. Uh, so, I guess kudos Dr. to me Craig for being Case nice. Defeated. Alright, uh, I will deal with that later in villainography. But I don't know why I couldn't put Legendary Bouncer on. Okay, well, skip that. Question remains, where's Legendary Treasure? So, 2500 and we got a new Sky Steamer. Alright. So we got current case capture from the X-Bone. We just need that legendary treasure. Oh, wait, we didn't get all the areas. Well, that explains that, doesn't it? Um, I guess his little lair doesn't count as an area. So, uh, at least that, I mean, that'll add up. That'll make sense to me. I don't know if when you do the, who was it, uh, Oh, the fire guy. Scrap shooter. I don't know if when you do that they access a new area or if we just miss something. Probably just miss something. But uh, pretty close to it. Uh, so really nice battles in there, especially at the beginning. I think that was maybe uh, the most intense. But uh, final battle was pretty good too. We could have killed uh, Crank, or Crankcase, Dr. Crankcase, when he got pinned over there. But I felt bad, and so I just kind of let him escape. <laughs> and uh, took it from there. But uh, let's see here. There is a lot of people watching this for this time in the morning. But um, let me see here. I'll, I'll catch up on the chat in just a little bit. We'll go back to the academy, I guess. So. Got to go back there and find the legendary treasure. Which I bet it would be a pretty cool one, actually. Holy guacamole! Can't believe those punks snatched chaos right out from under our noses. Well, he is kind of a little guy. No big loss, though, right? Huh? Maybe. But what do you think the Doom Raiders could want with him now? Well, I just might have the answer there, Buzz. According to my strange anomaly detector, I'm detecting a very strange anomaly around the clock of Skylands right now. Whatever happened to the information squid? My guess is they need chaos for their ultimate weapon, so Wolfgang took him to the clock where they are attempting to change the very fabric of time somehow. That sounds terrible and kind of confusing. Sounds like the Tower of Time. Stop him. Him. Okay, so we have another present. I've got a ton of those stacked. Ooh, what have we here? I don't know if we can go to that. Or not, but it looks cool. So we'll we'll investigate that. Sadly, without the legendary treasure, I mean, I don't have like anywhere I can take you. That's cool and special. I hope those are all still stacked because I've left a bunch of them there. <laughs> so, all right, we finally got around him. Uh, I've got a lot of villains I need to do the quests with now, so that'll be something I can do this week, hopefully. Um, where would that connect? Is it? Oh, no, not there. Must be through the second tower, I guess. Wait, why is he running up there? You're supposed to be down there. What is he doing? Why is he walking around like a crazy man? You ready to rock? No. <laughs> I just wondered why you were walking around instead of standing there. Now he's moonwalking. Crossbones is moonwalking. He is a man on the move and he is going nowhere fast here at 4.34 in the morning. Uh, we, uh, I was going to say we could do that too, but we can't really. So He's got some skills there, no doubt. Alright. Outer walkway. And the question I have is can we actually go anywhere else. Are those things just for decoration or can we actually do something with them? Let's find out. Okay, so that's mini area. Where are our new towers at? Huh. Well, let me climb that ladder. Oh, 
I don't know. Not quite sure uh, where that would take us. Now, this time I'll drop down here and see. Okay, so this one is safe. The first one is not. <laughs> That's good to know. That's an epic bounce pad right there. Um, we've got a little bit there. So let's try to land this. And then we've got this one. We're going to go back down. Wait, what does this one do? Okay. So let me try to not land on this one. I'm trying to get a better feel for this place. Okay, I think maybe just the first one would be the ditch you want to avoid. And, well, we hit our head there. And he stops. I don't know why. Oh, wait, 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 what is that? What is that? No, 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 you're gonna... You're gonna get that thing. I don't know what that is, but... Nope, that's not... Yes, 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 yes. You know what? Let me switch to a smaller profile character. Like... Kickoff Countdown. Pulling chomp chest too, by the way, just so he doesn't talk to us. Not that I don't want him to talk to us, but, you know. Alright, so let's see what Kickoff Countdown can do for us. Oh, he's got a really cool jump, or I guess like rocket and... Well, wow, that was like some serious lag right there. Bombs away! Okay. And right there, man, that's why I'm not able to get to it. No, 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 you're gonna land on that wood. Thank you. Okay. Should be a little trinket of something. Let's find out. Awesome. It's like a goo teddy bear. Billy Bison. Okay. Um... No, he's too cool for that. So, I liked in uh, Swap Force how you could, like, you know, shoot in the special stage when you dropped in the fountain and see the projectiles coming at you and stuff. Let's just, I guess, follow the coins here. And now, we know that would be towards the exit, so what is down here? Well, there's, like, any more trinkets hidden. Alright, so this is a pretty good cash cow here. Skyrocket! Oh, he doesn't need any money, though. He's fully upgraded. Let me switch back to someone else. Uh, Trailblazer will take reins here. Guess I should've... I don't know, I just thought it'd be cool to use Kickoff Countdown for a second. Rising heat. I'll try to remember to actually throw down... Legendary Bouncer, and make sure he, like, will work in this game. Okay. You know what? Let's see if we can get that. Yes, we did. So, was it worth the risk? No, but we took it. Because I do stupid stuff. Alright, um... I can do all of this off-camera, because it's, like, almost 5 in the morning. <laughs> you know... And uh, the shorter I can make the stream, the easier it is for me to highlight. I've actually probably never had one this long. But uh, anyway, and l the sad thing to me is we didn't get the legendary treasure, and that's what I could show you here. But um, I don't guess I know how to access those towers. Um, I, maybe they're just there for looks or something. I honestly just I do not know. Um, I'm excited about it. Um, uh, seeing how the chapter, you know, progresses with chaos being kidnapped by Wolfgang, which is awesome because that means we're probably getting closer to trapping Wolfgang, who's been my most anticipated villain. But uh, I'll clear all this stuff out, and uh, we'll kind of take it from there. Before I do, uh, I'll check out the chat here. Again, this is a lot of people for this time in the morning, really. Uh, let's see here. Let me come up and go... Da -da -dun. Well, a lot of happened since I got to look. Alright. Series 1 Zook, he was actually available uh, in pretty significant quantities at my local Toys R Us. Single pack form. Uh, 
Danganronpa is missing Prison Break, Boomer, Voodoo, Warnado, Camo. You can find the Camo, Warnado, Igniter triple pack pretty easy. It's pretty awesome. Uh, you can get all three adventure packs, but it's very very hard to get the fourth one, which would be Dark Light Crypt. Um, Wham Shell, I always felt like he was kind of hyped too much, in my opinion, but uh, he's ridiculously hard to find. Uh, let's see here. Da -da -da, the Floral Defender, yes, I've covered that many times. It is one of the most underrated pass in the game. Um, let's see here. Uh, who are my villagers in Animal Crossing New Leaf? Uh, original villagers remaining, I've got Bettina, Kurt, uh, Rosie. Um, those are the only three originals I've kept. Maybe. Leonardo recently moved. I didn't want him to. Um, I've got Opal. She will not move. I want her to. <laughs> um, uh, Eric, he moved in the other day after Leonardo left. I've got Pearl, a cat pretty much just like Rosie. Uh, Agent S, the super squirrel. Um, Whitney, who is awesome. And... Uh, Eugene, he's a pretty unique guy. I've debated letting him go. Uh, Drago, I'm a big fan of his, and I think that is my 10 right now. Uh, Chaos is definitely sensitive. Gearshift has done quite well. Um, tried to get that chest forever. I'm not sure which one that was in relation to, because I'm backtracking. Nitro Headrush, I honestly haven't heard anything on her. I just know that it's going to be a pain to find her uh, since it's Target. So I'm very worried about that. Let's see here. Oh, da -da -dun. Trying to catch up. Okay, I think I have caught up on the chat. So <laughs> that's, that's good. Uh, so... It's 4.42 in the morning, unless my clock is frozen or something. But uh, I think I'll do all this stuff off camera. Um, the towers are here, I just I don't know how to get to them. I guess maybe they could be up here. Uh, it doesn't look like they are. But maybe they interconnect somehow, I cannot see. So we'll, I'll run up here, and then we'll kind of call it quits, I guess. But I uh, got some bonus, you got a whole bonus chapter out of it. I should probably be asleep right now. <laughs> but, uh, you know, live and learn. So, up we go with Trailblazer. And this was the only other point I was thinking might actually have them present, and that's not the case. So, I don't know. If I find the uh, towers, I'll let you know. You won't really miss anything, but uh, I am freezing. I am very tired, and uh, this is a pretty long stream, so I uh, hope everybody enjoyed it. I'm going to, like I said, run through here, kind of do all this little special extracurricular activities, and uh, I will uh, catch you all back here next time. Tomorrow night, or I guess tonight now, Monday night, um... I may actually record some Minecraft again. Press what is going on here? Seems like we have glitched enemy. majorly. Then press the tag um, the I am in the academy. Okay. That was weird. <laughs> uh, that was bonus content as well for you. But uh, what was I saying? I think I'm going to record some Minecraft. Xbox One, get back on that tomorrow. What is this? Okay, I guess I just hadn't seen that before. But uh, I guess I'll work on that, and then I'll probably do the villainography, in all honesty. We've got a ton of villains now. What? Is oh, that gym was going to roll away. But a uh, ton of villains, I need to kind of get caught up on that. I've got a few more upgrade sessions. I'll probably uh, kind of get rolling on the ball with that. And then, uh, who knows, maybe... I don't know, Wednesday, Thursday, if things go well with all the villainography. Uh, which that may take a while, it depends on the quest, how long those go together. But uh, I want to get those done, particularly Chomp Chest and Pain Yada, plus we got a bunch of new ones now. But uh, I'll take it from there, and then I guess we'll just see next time. Uh, get back on the uh, 
live streaming of the chapters here. So that said, I will also try to do the uh, what we missed stuff, maybe get some of those uploading before I progress as well. So uh, that said, uh, stay tuned for more. If you don't follow me on Twitch, make sure you do that. You can follow me on uh, Twitter, like me on Facebook, circle me on Google+, Plus, whichever you prefer. Uh, again, uh, why all the random stops and chats and everything? This was live streamed on Twitch, and then what I do is export it over here to YouTube, where most of you will probably see it. Uh, if you want to be part of the live chat or check it out on Twitch, see things go down in real time, uh, make sure to follow me there, twitch.tv slash one of wisdom. Uh, if you like what you see on my personal site, one of wisdom.com, be sure to check out the Skylander Club forum. You can find it at skylanderclub.com. But again, uh, next little batch of content is going to be a whole bunch of villainography. Uh, a couple of upgrades we'll squeeze in, maybe of our legendaries uh, that we have remaining. And uh, after that, we will dive back into the live stream, Chapter 12. So stay tuned for that. Once again, thanks for watching, and uh, I will catch you back here next time.